Hey gang, AV here. Uh, still sick. Although, honestly, it's, uh, it's beyond a head cold now. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever read or saw Stephen King's The Stand, but I'm pretty sure I'm dying of that, uh, mucus disease that wiped out most of the nation, if not the world. <laughs> um... Yeah, it sucks. Anyway, um, on a lighter note, got my package today from the UK. Cool, good stuff. Um, it's packaged pretty flimsy, I gotta admit. And, uh, yeah. And, uh, even though I'm, uh, I'm doped up on, uh, cold medicine right now, which is why I drew a, uh, a stoned rabbit on the cover. Because that's what I do when I'm doped up on pay on a uh, cold medicine. I draw weird stuff. Anyway, because it's such flimsy packaging, I figured I'd do my very first unboxing for you guys. Especially since I already know what's in there, and it's kind of cool. So let's break out the uh, the Gerber. There we go. Uh, very nice. See if I can do this on camera here. I think we can get it up there. Yeah, that's not going to work. All right. Eek. Hopefully that's good enough. What is that? It's like a folder. Oh boy. Gotta be very careful. Not to hurt the books inside. Honestly, I'm not surprised by the packaging. Um, very nice lady I bought these from over in the UK, but quite honestly, not a comic book person. Very nice though, just not a comic book person. So I'm not all that surprised that the packaging was as flimsy as it was. But, oh, there, there you go, right on top. Now you can see why I bought it. The UK edition of uh, Amazing Spider-Man 252. Very cool. It's actually a different issue number. Um, if Mr. I Talk Apple is watching, he can clue us in on uh, whether or not I'm right when I say this. But it's, uh, I believe these come out twice a month. So it's like issue 600 and something, I think, instead of 252. Don't know where the issue number is. Uh... Oh, there it is. 631. Awesome. Very cool. Very cool. <laughs> is that coming in okay? Yeah. 630. Oh, yeah. This was uh, 632, 630, and uh, just to give you guys an idea, this is a U.S. This is a U.S. comic, so you can see the size difference. These are the same size as magazines, and this one's still got tattoos. Check that out. Awesome. 635 629 Night of the Sorcerer That's a new story
Wow, check that out. These are in nice shape. Very cool. Weird that it's half what half black and white, the other half color though. It's a little odd. Very cool though. Here's a uh, 633. Another free uh, sticker. Attached to that one. This is issue issue number 625. 626 627 628 Very cool. And uh this is what they mean by four color comics. Awesome. Very cool. <laughs> these aren't the first British comics I've had before, but these are the first Spider-Man comics I've ever had from over there. Very excited. Uh, the lady I bought these off of... Ooh, a pinup page. Check that out. The lady I bought these off of had a couple more. I might have to go pick them up off of her. Here's Quicksilver. A bunch of the Inhumans. Huh. I wonder what that backstory is from. This is awesome. Captain America. A what if story. Raiders of the Lost Ark. Nice. Very cool. Let me show you the covers again before I wrap it up. So that was uh, 628. Here is uh, 627. 626. 625 with the free uh, sticker thingy. 626. British comics often gave you like free little toys and stickers and tattoos and all sorts of stuff. And they would just be taped or glued to the front cover. Very cool. Awesome, man. I'm looking forward to reading these. Look at that. I, might ha I just might have to get the rest of them off of her. This is awesome. Uh, 633. 629. 635 with the tattoos. 630. 632 and the Big Daddy 631 and let me see since I've got it handy I can give you a uh, a side-by-side -side shot so you guys can see what it looks like next to the real deal or the US release I should say Pretty cool. Very cool. All right, well, that was the tail end of my uh, eBay haul. Um, 
and it was my very first unboxing or I guess unwrapping I could call it um, if you like this video check out my channel if you like what you see there then please subscribe and as always thanks for watching